Okay, now look at this cool looking interface on which I got all the information about the phone. The phone model flashes on the top with OS information. We have got available storage, battery health information with current battery temperature, its size and the technology used. Then we have got the CPU information in live graph by tapping on which we can see the processor, the cores, usage information and many more details. We also have more information on the phone screen, the storage, the network information with ping, data download and upload information. This is quite comprehensive detail about the phone on a very simple application called GCPU which can monitor the CPU RAM and battery and show many more details about the phone. And it also offers a couple of informational widgets which looks great. A very interesting application which you must check out. Alright now let's say you want to communicate to someone who is sitting a little far away from you in a particular place and uh, you can't really talk to them loudly. In such scenarios all you need is an application called LED banner. Now on this application you can just type what you want to communicate and just display the phone screen to the other person who is sitting far away from you. The big bold text will scroll through the screen. The other person will be able to read it very easily without any issues. You get the point here, right? This offers different background styles and colors and this application can be used in different scenarios and I'm sure you would know it better. So go ahead, check this application out. You're going to love it. Now just look at this cool looking graph over here. This is showing me all my monthly expenses and the split of it right here on top. Now this application is called Automated Expense Tracker. Now as the name suggests, this application is going to track all your expenses incurred every month and it's going to show you in graphical representation so that you can understand it better. And it will also give the split of all the expenses every month. Now this is going to do this by going through all your messages in the inbox. I know you'll be worried about giving the access to the banking application but no this is not going to get the access to the banking apps. It's going to read only the messages that you get inside the uh, messaging application and track all your expenses. Now this application is something similar to another application from Microsoft. I hope that rings a bell. Yes, this is similar to Microsoft's SMS organizer application. It works more or less the same. It reads all your messages which is coming to your inbox and collates the data and shows your expenses and income details. That's how it works. Now, if you want to track all your expenses in a better way, this is the application which will help you do that. Go ahead, download it, install it and let me know what you think about it in the comment section. Now, moving on, the next application is a fantastic wallpaper application called Abstracts. Now, if you're looking for some beautiful abstract wallpaper, with some beautiful designs then this is the one you should check out. The moment you open the application it has got this cool looking interface. It's quite simple at the bottom we've got three tabs wallpapers collections and favorites. In the collections you can see we've got different categories here. All these wallpapers are very nicely crafted. Now this application is a premium app of course this is not a free application. Now if you're looking for free wallpaper applications I have already posted a few of them on the channel. You can check out the links in the description. There are some fantastic free wallpaper applications on which you will find some beautiful wallpapers go ahead and check the links in the description now let's move on to the next application that is called touch the notch now this is a very very interesting application this is going to make use of the camera cutout area and turn it into a action button yes you can just tap on this punch hole camera or the selfie camera to execute some action that sounds crazy isn't it let's go ahead and check out how it works you see when you open the application we've got single touch option long touch option double click option and swipe right to left action. Now let me just open single touch action. Now here you can see we have got a list of actions which can be set for single touch. We have got toggle camera flashlight, take a screenshot, open the power button, long press menu etc. Uh, we can just select the one you want. Let's say I select toggle camera flashlight. Now when I tap on the camera the flashlight turns on. When I tap on that again the camera flashlight turns off. Now this is how it works. We can execute different actions by tapping on the punch hole camera or the selfie camera on your phone. These are some of the best picks for January 2024 and this best application series will continue this year. So stay tuned for all the videos. Every month I'm going to post a video with best applications for the month and the rest of the contents on Samsung will continue on the channel. So stay tuned for some more interesting contents coming up and uh, be sure to subscribe to the channel and give this video a thumbs up if you find this video informational. Thanks for watching. My name is Salian signing off. Cheers. Bye-bye.